In this video, I'm going to do a review on this AF Hima fencing mask. And for this fencing mask, you can use it to practice fencing. You can also use other types of swords that are made of metals or wood, and you can practice it on this fencing mask as well, like a machete, knife, or whatever type of blades there are. And of course, they're not real, they're made of other types of materials that you can use on this mask. This is the front part of the mask. It feels pretty strong to me. And this is the size of the fencing mask here. And as you can see, this has the protection right here. And down here around the neck, this has this padded on the back of the mask. You can see that there's this part to keep the fencing mask and hold it onto your head. This is the pad around your neck here, all the way from here up to here, okay? Inside of this mask, there's also this pad here. So in case if someone is to hit you, you know, your head doesn't hit to this part of this mesh here, but instead it's headed to this pad. Just for the protection. Inside here, it also has a tab. It says AF Absolute Fencing Gear, and it has the website absolutefencinggear.com. It has the EN number, and it has uh, the size, they say uh, this is size medium and it's a level one. It also has a warning label in here. You can just kind of check the mask out and see. This part here is the aligners. So you can remove it like this. So you will remove the liner and then just, uh, this is the liner here. I'm gonna stick the liner back. This is just uh, for the um, support and protections of the neck here. Around the neck area. <laughs> this thing is so sticky, oh my goodness. Uh, okay, let me see. Okay, not too bad. This thing really stick and it is good because it doesn't slip off easily. Because when you stick it to each other, then it will be uh, secure and, and stable like this. This is the AF Hema fencing mask. What I would do is I will wear it and I will show you how it looks like. So you just stick your head into the mask and behind this, you just stick this two part together. And now the mask stay on your head and this is a medium sign, but still there's a little bit or some room that the mask can move around my head. Usually like when you wear a motorcycle helmet, you want to make sure it's secure. And then for this mask here, I felt like there's still some space that the fencing mask can be moving around. And this is a medium size. And now I'm going to do a test on the fake blade to hit it against my helmet to see how it works. So this is a metal knife, it's not real. And when you're practicing, then let's say if your partner is stabbing you into your face when you practice, then this is how it sounds like. It doesn't hurt me or anything. The first time when I wear the fencing mask and someone like stab me onto my face like this, onto the fencing mask like this, it felt terrifying, uncomfortable. But after a while, you get used to it. When you use um, any fake blades to practice on the fencing mask, I would say just to manage your force on it rather than for you just to go 
like all of your force into it even though uh, they have good protection an accident may happen even though people are aiming at the face but if you are hitting it and accidentally touch the person's skin then it's gonna be um, severe injury and you don't want that to happen how is it sound like and how is it feel like it doesn't hurt me at all so you want to be careful and not hitting way too hard into the head because still there's a uh, protection but i mean anything is hitting down to your head with force that's not going to be a good feeling to have this is better than here and if you use like a wood blade to hit on the mask then this is how it sounds like so pretty much this is the fencing mask, pretty uh, cool. I really like this mask a lot. So I just want to share with you. And if you're looking for a fencing mask, this is an option that you can look into and check it out and see how you like it. Alrighty, everyone. Thank you for watching. Have an amazing day. Take care now. Bye-bye.